Hey, Sean. Breakfast is ready. Let's go eat. So the plan for today is um, we are going to finish framing the top part of that uh, uh, utility closet that we missed and then hopefully get the sheetrock put into that closet so that we'll be done with that. And there is also an eclipse happening today and we plan on going over to the big cleared lot and uh, viewing that. We stopped by the Home Depot last night and picked up some... Uh, uh, glasses so that we can look at the eclipse without burning our brains out um, so we're gonna do that sorry I got a gust of smoke right in the face burn ban has finally been lifted out here so we're able to have us a little fire it was nice and brisk this morning felt really good so that's the plan for right now All right, so in that closet where there wasn't any uh, structure to fasten the sheetrock to, we're just winging it. We're still trying to figure out a solution. We think we have an idea. So I'm going to start cutting some pieces of two by four and we're going to start piecing them in there and see if we can't build some kind of skeleton structure to secure the sheetrock to on the top part of that closet. So here we go. It's a lot of weed you got. It's a lot of weed. It is a lot of weed. <laughs> So just creating stacks so that the sheetrock will have an attachment point. And working around some electrical wiring just so I don't have to notch around it. Okay. We're going to go inside and install this. Looks like delicious M&Ms. Yeah. Yeah, they've got higher iron content, though. They're not very good. <laughs> So due to the space constraints that we have in the tiny cabin, we're going with a tankless water heater and it is electric. So once we get electricity out here, we'll be able to hook that up. But we're putting that in the laundry closet and it's going to go up there. We're going to put a piece of plywood up there so we have a secure place to fasten it to. And that's where our water heater is going to be. It's not very big, this wide, maybe this tall. And uh, that'll give us instant hot water, hopefully. Yeah, I need a 
love them. All right, so what we've done is we've added these spacers here. Again, not a professional. Figuring it out the best I know how as a non-carpentry dude. Uh, and then we put this piece here so that we have some place to secure she rock to. We're going to do basically the same thing on this side and then I'll have to figure out something <clears throat> possibly for the middle. Maybe, maybe not. I'm not sure yet. Uh, oops, I'm crooked. Sorry. Uh, ADD, I was looking at what I was doing instead of filming. So, yep, so we're going to redo this on this side. You're going to make everybody dizzy with the way here. <laughs> and then we're going to figure out the middle. So we were able to take a break and uh, go do a little deer hunting. It's archery season right now. So I was able to go set in the deer blind. Didn't see any deer, but it was sure a beautiful evening to set out. Some new sleepwear for the cabin for this weekend. Was it? Sure. <laughs> okay, hold on. So, does this put you in the mood? <laughs> that is. <laughs> So the framing is finished. Now we're gonna start with the ceiling and then get the walls drywalled and we will be done. Still putting in more boards to make sure that we have attachment points for the sheet rock. It's a little challenging getting in tight spaces. Um, go, go, come back out and go to that corner. Yeah. We have found most of the rooms that she rock has made them look bigger. This one is making it shrink up quite a bit. We'll see when we're done.
So the top part above here, we told you that's where the water heater is gonna go. We think we've decided that we're not gonna sheetrock that at all. We're just gonna put up a big piece of plywood so that it has something solid to mount to and not even worry about sheetrock. All right, let's go see how bad I screwed it up. I think it looks great. Yeah. I think it looks like a work of art. Beautiful. This has never happened before. Sean has a broom and he's sweeping. <laughs> because you're always riding it. I know. <gasps> Just kidding, sweetheart. Wow, it hurt my feelings. Just your little ones, man. There's my little ones. You still have your big ones. I have some big ones. We probably should have measured it to make sure that it was right before I started cutting everything. Because if we have to make adjustments to the width, it's gonna throw everything else off. Pretty fun. Hi, Valley. Is you ready? All right, we're getting closer. <gasps> Putting in the final screw for sheetrock. Oh, to go above the shower? Yeah. Oh. Okay, so fun. Check it out. Ta -da -da -da. All right, so then we'll do this around sound and then we'll do some kind of wire board apparently. All right, cool, cool. So, Time to go fill up the feeders and get some cold air and then we'll come back and clean? Yep. All right, let's do it. Definitely have deer. Yeah, I like the little window that shows you how much corn's left in there. I don't know why he bothers. He's gonna get his knife out in a second. He just likes to try it every time. <laughs> <laughs> good effort baby good effort if you have a tip to open that bag a little bit easier drop it in the comments Big feeder. You can see our food plot is starting to take. That's super fun. Since we didn't fertilize or put lime in the ground, I was very pleased to see that it's growing. Yesterday, while we were watching the eclipse, I started to build for a future bonfire, so that'll be fun. And then you can see in the window, it's got cone. All right, off to the next feeder.
Corey's feeder has got quite a bit of corn left out. I think Sean has stolen all the attention of the deer. taking the trailer home this weekend so we got to go get cleaned up get the trailer hooked up and somebody gave us a nice couch that we can put up here so uh, we're gonna need the trailer to go pick that up tomorrow yep and then we have some chairs to put on the porch and your feeder we can bring out next time yeah the feeder that i built we're gonna bring it out yeah so we'll have a trailer load coming back next time <laughs> sean you smell that you stink <laughs> <laughs> it was a little chilly last night. We planned on taking showers last night, but it was it was pretty cold last night, and we're like, eh, I'd rather stink than freeze. So, <laughs> even though the water is hot, we didn't want to go out in the shower. So, uh, we're both a little ripe. Hey! <laughs> so it's the end of another weekend. Uh, we're just wrapping up, but again, we wanted to thank you for uh, joining us along this adventure. If you like our content, please smash that like button and give us a subscribe. Give us a subscribe? Whatever. <laughs> uh, you, you guys know what I'm saying, right? And uh, as always, go have an adventure of your own. Bye. Bye.